Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today we're tackling a question that often puzzles developers. What is the difference between any and any square brackets? Let's break it down together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're gonna to be going through your question answering it and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully you get through that resolution. So let's continue on. Let's begin by understanding the difference between any and any in TypeScript. Any is a type that allows any value, while any is an array that can hold multiple values of any type. In example one, we see name one declared as any and name two as any. When we assign name two to name one, it works because any can accept any type, including arrays. In example two, the reverse assignment is also valid. Here, name one is assigned to name two. This works because any can also be assigned to any. Now let's address the question of which type is best to use. Generally, it's better to use specific types instead of any or any for better type safety and code clarity. Lastly, when using any, it can accept non-array types like strings or numbers without errors. This is due to the flexibility of the any type, but it can lead to potential runtime issues. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. The main difference between any and any in TypeScript is how they handle IntelliSense. When you declare a variable as any, TypeScript doesn't know its type, so you won't get IntelliSense features like map or join. But with any, TypeScript recognizes it as an array and provides IntelliSense. Compile time errors also differ. If you declare var aa any equals a, TypeScript will throw an error because aa must be an array. However, var a any equals a is allowed since a can be anything. Assigning a to aa won't trigger an error until runtime. Declaring a variable as any specifies that it should be an array, while any can be anything. TypeScript will catch errors when it can, but using any can lead to missed errors. For example, assigning a any to a a any should ideally trigger an error. At runtime, JavaScript doesn't enforce type checks, so accessing properties or methods on any can lead to errors only when invoked. For instance, calling a map on an any that isn't actually an array will result in a type error. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. The main difference between any and any is that any is used for a single object of any type, while any is used for an array of objects of type any. And that's it guys. I hope the video helped find that resolution you're looking for. And you know, if it did, please, I'd appreciate it if you could hit subscribe. Until next time guys, that you need more technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.